Let's let them know who really got it. Came up from the bottom, now we riding in a mozzie. And these my jealous done burnt to hold in my pocket. See me, I'm shining. Yo, what's going on, guys? It is your boy Bugs. And today, guys, we're going to be going over the Multiverses 1.02 patch. And if you want to read it on your own, it will be in the description. Unfortunately, they took it off their um you know their patch page like they have their website that they have um but we did get a screenshot of it of all of it so that's what we're gonna be going through today and let's get straight into the video now if y'all don't know guys gizmo is literally dropping tomorrow so literally in like 12 hours you're gonna play gizmo gonna be fun and cool can't wait to see that um spectator mode now now displays team colors properly hopefully this also adds in a way to get in expect made spectator mode way easier than what we have to do now to get into it so you know hopefully that's into it too um but the big update that we're all here for is the hitbox and hurtbox update this patch includes hurtbox updates overhaul and pretty much let's just get straight into how it looks yes guys this is how it looks now this is how it was before a little like pill looking shape and now it is literally tightened around the character and not only that, when they do their actual like attacks, it's also so instead of her hitbox being this pill looking shape, you can actually hit her leg. Like so if you're doing a sidekick or whatever, you're gonna actually punish her and stuff. And other characters obviously. I can't wait to see this tomorrow. This this should be a great feature and you know stop all those weird like hitboxes and when stuff don't hit you, for some reason it hits you. So this should definitely help, especially with local play 100 percent Obviously online it's still gonna be a little work with um service and stuff, but we should definitely still see an improvement with that also. Uh let's get back into the um the patch notes though. So another huge thing that's also happening is the projectile system. We're finally getting a proper system of how these projectiles work and how they interact with each other. You can read all of this if you want, but pretty much now they're standardizing the um, opposing projectiles to always clink, which means equaling to destroying both projectiles, which is very smart. I think that should have been a thing. Um, they're also introducing heavy projectiles, so you already know how um, Bugs Bunny, Safe, his rocket, um, Shaggy, Super Sandwich is going to be um, one of them too, and any other you know crazy thing. I want to say um, Taz's Anvil too. That's another will be another heavy projectile, and you know any other future ones will also be you know shown in the future. And as you can see, it says cannot be reflected, which makes sense. Um, barriers and buffs that project projectiles will more consistently block all projectiles. Lovely, can't wait for that to work. Projectiles that explode no longer hit um, fires that block um, the projectile, so most likely just Harley bomb and whatever else blows up. I can't think, maybe Morty's grenade. We'll see. That's awesome. Next, this is the biggest game changing, but I'm very scared to see that it's only keyboard and mouse. I hope this also means controller, because if it's only keyboard and mouse, keyboard and mouse might just be the way to play the game now. But right now, as you can see, it says directional um, attacks and specials can now be mapped to specific keyboard um, keys. For example, down attack can be mapped to a key so that you can perform a down attack without fast forwarding. In total, there are eight new key binds. Up attack, right attack, down attack, special alt. Pretty much you can press a button so you could do the move. That is game changing. I really hope controller also gets this. Obviously, we won't be able to use all eight buttons. Well, I mean, we could if we really wanted to. But I think we also deserve something like this because this is game changing. To be able to do something and press it to do one direction is kind of something. It's kind of like literally left attack, right attack, left special, right special. Like that's game changing. You can literally be going to the right and then just hit a quick left special or whatever. That's game changing. I really hope that's, you know, for both inputs. Um, next we have is um, some map changes. As you can see, the floor wall, ceiling bounce no longer restored. Dodge meter energy. That's good. So a little nerf on dodge meters finally. Improve input handling when up is ex executed at the same time as a jump. Um, before it was ignored, now it should do something. As you can see, you can read that along if you want to. Perk changes. Um, right now, clear the air. This has an updated description about you know heavy perks. You know it just won't affect non-heavy perks or non-heavy projectiles. Um, next we have is the ice BU projectiles will only apply ice projectiles to the fighters that are not already debuffed by ice. Again, I think that's been thing. It's just for local play now. Um, I'll take that. If I didn't know that, um, this was been implemented, but it just wasn't um, set in the description. But I'll take that is now at a 25 um, second um, when it's not stacked and when it's stacked is half a second. Been this been in the game, but now it will tell you, you know, so you're not thinking that you're running the same old perk. Make it rain actually got a nerf. Now it is going to be reduced to. 10 instead of 20 and then stacked it'll be 20 instead of 25 i think that's really good kind of was a little busted happy to see that um that's being added sturdy dodger fixed the issue where perk would not stack properly that's good to hear um tree um the tree uh, tree fort map actually got changed it is now 
15 health instead of 30 for the trampoline um, tree, so that's good. Um, Edge got a minor fix with collision and stuff, and it looks like Chromulon is actually getting changed, adding a new platform to both of the versions. That's interesting, can't wait to see that. Now we get into the characters' buffs, nerfs, and changes, and fixes. So one, guys, yes, all the assassins have finally got rid of that stupid passive. No more extra damage for being the assassin, for being faster. I'm happy to see that um, has been implemented. Bam, we don't have to deal with that no more. Um, next, they're reverting up um, her air up special, which is the whole um, consistent up special where you know it locks in and it's a complete kill. Um, I think this was this was um, something that we complained about a very long time ago, and I guess people forgot about it, and also PFG. And then when people were complaining, like, "Hey, why is this not doing it?" And they're like, "All right, we'll fix it." Not realizing that's what we kind of complained back then to get fixed because it was so consistent. Now you're able to DI out of it. Now, now you now they have to guess where you're gonna go left, right, up, and it could mess with you know her up special, so you have a fighting chance to get out of it. Um, next is her. Um, her up special fix that causes the dash to um, stop working after Taz turns into her chicken, so that's like a bug. And then um, a neutral fix uh, is no longer um, lingering hitboxes. So you remember how Arya can do her um, her stolen face and then drag it down and make it linger? That is gone, guys. Yes, no more BS random stuns anymore. Next we have is Batman. Batman projectile was not a steel of armor anymore it actually will play the role of a normal projectile so if another projectile hit it it will destroy it it won't just drop it on the ground that is amazing that is good it actually makes it so you can counter battering and it's just not you know in his hand every damn second um his air down special knock um, knockback angle change to send victims more horizontal that's good um side special or his air side attack when landing attack will allow um carrying movement momentum earlier you know when he does his um i think that's the the battering not the battering the, the grapple thing that he does so yeah that's good um round down special fix the bug where preventing projectile sidestep from dodging all projectiles fix the bugs causing the first jab delaying into the second jab so now your your jab is going to be more consistent that's good bugs bunny bugs bunny has been gutted guys now obviously this is not a, a nerf but Rocket is now classified as a you know heavy projectile. That's good. Um, and same thing with um, where is it? The safe, same thing. You know you can read that if you want. Um, now his down attack recovery land cancel window delays by two frames. His downside recovery land um cancel window delays by three frames. And then his up special hitbox active frames are reduced. His ground neutral frame to cancel into a neutral ground has been delayed. He's actually gotten lighter. I'm very surprised about that. I'm happy to see these changes. Hopefully this allows him not it allows him to be punished more now, even you know, on hit. I'm pretty sure this would mean because it's a recovery land. So that means when you hit somebody. So hopefully that allows him to get punished more and not be able to just hit and run away that like he's been doing. Um and then a big um nerf on the perk um is his hitbox activation of going through the tunnels or at a quarter of a second now instead of a half a second. I think that's good. It kinda lingered a little bit um for something that's supposed to be like a quick blast blast. So I'm happy to see that. Finn, again, passive, no more damage, woohoo. Um a passive increase this is his gold um to two hundred from a hundred. That's fine I guess. I again I still think you should shouldn't start with gold, but you know that's just me. Might be biased, but yeah. Um air ground neutral special fix an issue where the shockwave from the high five would uh, if you hit an ally would not um, hit enemies that's good you know that should be fixed um, adjust the vacuum to be more consistent in the combo that's fine that's cool um, increase minimum distance travel when it's down attack um I think I don't agree with that but hey we'll see how it goes tomorrow Garnet Garnet got some buffs her air ground neutral on um, Garnet bubbles and projectiles the projectiles will not be able to hit her as or her allies until the bubble expires I think that's awesome that's great there's that thing definitely need to be more better you know I, I think when she's in that singing bubble no projectile should hurt her besides you know heavy projectiles um her air ground side special increase projectile speed uh, from 22 to 2000 Is that ain't that a nerf then Oh, two from oh, so it's faster. So her ga gauntlets are faster. Okay, recovery frames decrease to allow for follow-up combos from the hit. Interesting. And then her air side, her side attack on hit cancel when um, move earlier. So side attack one combos better into side attack two. That's awesome. Um, Harley. <laughs> Again, we all got you. Also got the you know less damage um, taken because we're assassin, and then we got a speed increase by fifty. Um. I don't think this is really going to do anything. I think this is the same speed as Arya now. We shall see what happens. Like I said, maybe the hitboxes will definitely make um, Harley more playable, but we shall see. 
Um, next, Iron Giant. He um, got um, his passive nerf. Instead of having 30 gray health, he has 15. His air attacks reduced from 5, um, from 6. His air ground neutral ability um, ammo count cooldowns are now static cooldowns. Static cooldowns are not affected by cooldown um, reduction perks or buffs. Consuming an item, uh, Iron Giant I will still grant him one bolt. So there's no more buffs on him. So you can't run, I'll take him and all that stuff to decrease um, coffee zealot. None of that works on him. And I think that's good because kind of busted. Be able to use his bolts whenever you want to. It's kind of crazy. So happy to see that happen. Um, and then his air neutral got more with recovery increased. Really see an issue with that. It's, I'd say it was more of his hitboxes, so we'll see how he plays um, into tomorrow. Jake. Jake, um, air neutral special. If he eats multiple people, it, um, it'll all spit him out as once. I think that's good. It was kind of buggy. Sometimes people will walk out, some people were able to get it. It, it was weird. Happy to see that's been fixed. Um, also, it does weakening um, at 2 instead of 5. I think that's good. You know, I think it was kind of OD. But, you know, I'm happy to see that. Um, his air ground down special attack duration um, to 3 seconds from in. Um, from infinite duration that's good can no longer hit the same enemy multiple times if you don't know what that is that is his um the house pretty much that's good his air side attack with a car free increased by six yes land cancel window delayed to match the increase with recovery awesome on hit cancel window will move from two frames earlier awesome this should give the opponents more of a window to punish um jigs with yes that's exactly what we need we need to be able to punch i mean punish his side his stare that literally is like the most safe move that he has besides the house but that move happy to see that it's been gutted a little bit to be more playful and more fun to go against um air down attack damage reduced from the first two hits on uh, third hit and like less cool 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 LeBron, um, air down attack, knocked by angles, pushes more horizontal, that's fine, enemies can no longer hit his basketball, great fix, you know, that was something that buggy about him, um, ground neutral special, ground pass, projectile speed increase, I think that's awesome, uh, no ball, air, air side, um, active window frames move from 3 seconds earlier, that's great, um, ball ground attack, middle frames earlier, that's great, uh, one hit cancel, reliable, more combos, follow ups, that's great, Ball ground down, council window moved earlier. Great, I think that's awesome. Allow LeBron to do more LeBron things with the basketball. I think that'd be awesome to see him have more combos than what he has now. Morty. Morty's finally getting his passive, so he's actually going to be usable, guys. His air ground neutral ammo count has been increased, so it looks like they're you know nerfing that already. Um, but they're scaling his knockback a little bit, so that's awesome. Grenades cannot be knocked by allies' projectiles, but when it comes to any projectiles, it will destroy it. Makes sense. Great. Um, his air ground special makes the issue where more ally will randomly pull. That's awesome. The save point actually works now, so it only trigger when they're near a blast zone. And that was the biggest thing that we all complained about, that it would just randomly pop. So I'm happy to hear about that. Um, his air side special portal gun on uh, reticle are now only be shown by Modi player. That's awesome. That means um, other people can't see it. Great. Um, grind sound special is more consistent with projectile. That's the rock move. Awesome. You know, that's if you didn't know, that move literally stops projectiles and blocks it. So awesome to see that, you know, it'll do that better. Great. Uh, air ground neutral attack. Fixed an issue where blasters could shoot too. You never see this at all, but I'm happy that's fixed. Um, but they also scaled the knockback on it, which is amazing. And the same thing with the ground up is the same thing. The, the bug, they fixed it and then increased their scaling. That's awesome. Ground sign attack, full combo jab connects more reliable. Awesome. Love it. And then they fixed the feeble juice to do more, which will be Tom Jerry's mousetrap. Cleans up Garnet's electric zone. I think there was a little bit more they should do, but I'm happy to see that, um, those fixes are in rain dog rain dogs up um air or ground neutral enemies can no longer hit the spit projectile that's great i don't think no character should just hit you know a projectile just hit a projectile um up attack vacuum knockback applies to his hit first to help with the second hit chain to get it more reliable that's awesome you know because if you didn't know <laughs> rain dogs up attack is a two hit and you know it should do its job so i'm happy to see that um ground neutral attack holding down dodge and you know, can no longer cancel into the next attack quickly preventing extremely rapid fire projectiles that's awesome i see a lot of people abusing this this was not meant to be him to be shooting his projectile like a f damn machine gun so i'm happy to see that's gone shaggy shaggy got some nerfs so shaggy rage um air and um ground down special super sandwich cannot classify as a heavy projectile makes sense um is air ground side special bug correctly branches to other tags from non-range side special i think that's awesome they fixed that correctly is ground attack um removed armor from attack and knocked by angle push to be more horizontal awesome that means no more armor armor break slow move all in one and 
um, no more loop. They they took this out, so you can do the loop a little bit more. Um, obviously, you could probably still kind of do it at an extent, but um, it'll help it not you know mess people up and you know hit them in a hundred damage a loop. So that's awesome. This one I'm really shocked about. His weight got lowered to 68. I'm really surprised. Like I said, I get it. He's a meme character, the one percent power thing, ultra instinct shaggy. It makes sense, but hey, I'm happy to see that he's kind of playing into his role of a bruiser and not a tank. <laughs> Um, ground up special, jump cancel, ground up special delay to prevent true combos. Again, they fixed that to where, um, if you do jab, jab, up special, it's not a true kill anymore. Like, you can't just get a free kill because you're, um, super staying up. So, awesome. I think that's really great. Um, <laughs> Steven Universe getting a nerf. Nah, he didn't get a nerf, guys. Um, he actually just got a fix, which is, uh, if you use your up special. Oh, no, no, sorry. This is, this is, um, not the fix. This is, um, to prevent stalling so after using two up specials um steven must land on the solid ground before he can spawn uh, more shields of his up special so you can't stall in the air forever anymore that's what they decided to do is give him two shields out there and then after that you have to go and land on the ground before you get another shield which i think is awesome it makes the most sense great awesome cool superman superman up special uh, fix where it could grab enemies from far away from bouncing um off the walls later start up on active frames awesome um, his air side special fix a bug where we could grab enemies far away from the bounce of walls. Light speed is reduced after Superman grabs an enemy, so he won't carry enemies so far. Awesome! It'll that'll stop like less gimping um, on Superman. Air slash ground special now has an ammo ground. Superman spawns with two ammo ground, one new ammo every eight seconds. So that means he has a limit of two of the lasers, and he can't just sit and spam it over and over and over. Awesome! I'm happy to hear that. Less you know projectile spamming. Brown attack hitbox um, active frames reduce. Brown up hitbox just to attack no longer hits behind him. Awesome. Happy to see that. Taz. Let's see what the Taz buffs are. So Taz skin fix. It looks like he got his um his skin um icon fixed. His passive TD um tasty has been increased to 18 instead of 16. Interesting. Um looks like the chicken um moves slower. Um, looks like the chicken that you can eat on the ground um, has been reduced to 15. I didn't even know it gave up that much health. That's a lot. 30 is a lot, actually. Um, chicken reduced um, to 6 seconds. So it only lasts for 6 seconds. So it's, it had its benefits and it has its cons. So it's okay. Um, his air ground neutral. Taz can now eat and spit bug safe. Rocket. Shaggy super sandwich. Awesome. It makes sense. Shaggy. I mean, Taz is like a goofy character. Should be able to eat any projectile in the game. Um, eating an enemy in the air now applies to weakening. Awesome. I think that's smart because, you know, if you eat people in the air, you just can't do anything. It just spits them out. So I'm happy to see that. Um, air ground special on a cooldown tornado increase to 45 instead of 2.5. I'm happy to see that. Maybe even it should have been at half a second because I'm not going to lie, guys, that 25 is like literally when I say it's so that the active frame is like as soon as the animation happens, it ends like that's how fast it is. So maybe, like I said, maybe a half a second, maybe even 75, um, 0 0.75 seconds, but we'll see. Um, but you know, it's, it's a start. Um, air ground down special recovery frames um, decrease to allow better combos. So if you not, if you don't know what that is, the apple. So you're able to do more combos with it. Can't wait to see what Taz players come up with that. The iron stomach perk is now classified as a heavy projectile. That's smart as it should be. Um, and then his signature perk, Taz allies can only enter their dog pile once per use. I think that's awesome because there was a bug where you could just get in and get out as much as you want, which is really weird. So happy to see that. Tom and Jerry. Tom and um, Jerry no longer hits enemies immediately after the rocket explodes. Awesome. Jerry now qualifies a heavy projectile. Makes sense. No longer refreshes on cooldown when he dies with his attached to an ally. Makes sense. Corkscrew reduced to two instead of three. I mean, I don't think that was an issue, but okay. Um, his side air cracks adds three frame recovery. Land and cancel. Delayed by seven frames. Okay. Um, air down attack added three frames recovery. That's good. Land cancel recovery. That's awesome. I think you know having a delay on his pan would be more punishable. Happy to see that. Ground side um, jab one hitbox active frame window move two frames later. Interesting. Dynamite um, split perk split dynamite sticks now dynamite when they hit carry on. So that means like just the ground and stuff. I think that's smart. Um, I didn't like how it could bounce and stuff, and he's able to debate with it and stuff. That's good that if it touches the ground, then it loses it. Um, Definitely want to see a little bit more, you know, Jerry, Jerry nerfs, but I'm happy to see what we have right now. Velma and um, her passive. Instead of calling the cops, Velma now solves the mystery and calls the mystery ink gang. And the awesome, love to see that. Love, 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 love it. Um, her up special no longer applies weakening stacks on hit. 
awesome. I think she definitely needed that. She just had so much in her kit. I'm happy to see that that's gone, you know. Give give us something less than her. Thank you. Um her air ground neutral no longer heals Velma when she hits allies with a speech bubble. Awesome. Happy to see that she's not just running around with her speech bubble and able just to heal whenever. That's great. Movement speed reduced by 100. Her weight reduced again to 52. I don't think there's going to be a big difference, but that's awesome to hear. You know, make her a little bit more balanced. I think I think I like where she's at right now. The fact that she can't heal herself and she can't give weakening, but she has everything else, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. I think she's going to be good where she's at now, but we'll see. Um, and then finally, we're going to end it off with Wonder Woman. Air ground special no longer counts as a projectile. I think that's good. You know, I don't think it should count as a projectile at all. Her ground um, down attack no longer breaks projectiles while charging. I'm guessing if she was charging, it just broke projectiles, which I never noticed. I thought she had to let go for it to do that. That's very interesting. Um, her weight got reduced to 71. Very surprised about that. You know, they just gave her her weight, but, you know, it is what it is. And it also made her a little bit slower. Not by that much, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, that's it for the patch notes guys comment down below what y'all think about these patches how how y'all feeling about it We'll see how tomorrow plays out my biggest concern is these hitboxes guys you already know these hitboxes looks mm, So scrumptious. I can't wait, but leave a like if you like the video comment anything You know, I love y'all comments like I said comment about what y'all think about these patch notes and if it's your first time you watch one of my videos And you do enjoy uh, multiverses content then hit the subscribe button guys. I'm out. Peace yeah, she got a man, she don't really give a fuck about Left him back home in a whole nother state Moved to LA cause she wanna be famous Got another five on her side, she a waitress But it's getting tough, hard to find out